Hello, welcome back to Engineering Sound. In this video tutorial, I will explain if you have irregular area or any shape of area, land, anything plot, so how you can divide it in the equal parts. Suppose if you have the owner, three, four, five owners of the land, so you can divide it very easily by the help of Lisp. So the Lisp I will give you in the description. You can download from the description. Please don't forget to like share and subscribe my channel let's start the video for example this is a simple example we have this area we want to divide it in three four uh, however how much parts you need you can divide it is very easily no matter how is the shape of land you can divide it with the help of lisp okay so let's start the video First of all, we will check the area with the list command. Okay, make okay. This is our area. So let's copy the area and open the quick calculator from AutoCAD QC for the quick calculator. You can use it. Okay, paste the area here so we can see how much is our total area and per person how much is required to give and divide in parts let's paste here the total area in the calculator okay and divide suppose we need three four five how much let's divide it in three part we need in three parts this okay for one owner for the one person the area is coming this one let's copy this one and paste here here is the let's draw a line from here suppose straight line okay and we will go to upload the list from here you can upload from the manage and also you can put the command ap upload and select and select load once let's close okay now we will enter the command from the command bar cd this is okay and remember this this lisp is uh, created by some uh, I think with Namin engineer so the language will be changed you should do the same practice so you can uh, you can understand how I'm doing let's select the polyline and the second you select the straight line and now you need to pick the area which one you need to make it as per person okay and enter the area per person which we divide by three let's paste here okay this is the area and enter okay here we need to select the s okay now you will see the line is move and the area is okay the area is completed for one person so for the next person we will divide in a minute okay let's wait for this it will take a moment okay now you need to click on the okay button because it's saying in uh, some methnoming that the process is complete let's click on the ok button okay now we will copy this line and uh, same copy for here to do the same practice for the next person let's put it here somewhere okay and enter now we will do again the same practice let's go to the command bar and put the command cd okay and press enter now it's saying to you to select the polyline we will select the polyline okay and next the straight line we will select and next we will pick the area where we want to create this area okay let's enter this is per person okay and here you can enter and click on s build okay and now, now you will see that it's move toward the other session it's mean that the area is divided successfully per person this area now i will show you are our area is correct or not i will check one by one okay you should do it for 30 second now it's saying that it's completed and click on ok button this is the three part we divided into three so first of all we will trim the extra lines from here by the help of trim command tr okay now we will do what we should to do to boundary 
the three sections separately this is separate and again I take pick point and separate and again bo click this one and make it separate okay so now you have three areas and we will check the area one by one let's check list okay and click here and select enter now you can see the area 54153 and 3.49 so the 100% the area is corrected okay and now you can see the second one let's click list and check the area as same 54153 and 349% correct okay and let's check the third one and we will click list and next enter you can see 54153 349% the area is corrected if you multiply this section by 3 you will get the total area which you look on the top 162460 dear students and dear fellows i hope you guys learn from this video we will see in the next tutorial please don't forget to like share and subscribe goodbye take care